Hello everyone, in this video we are just going to interface LDR that is light dependent resistor with our analog channel of Arduino Uno development board. Let's get started. So before going to the programming part, let me explain in detail about the working principle of this LDR that is the light dependent resistor. So this light dependent resistor as the name says, it is a resistor which will vary its resistance based on the light that is falling on it. Initially it will be having a certain resistance and when more light is passed on the surface of this LDR the resistance will be drastically reduced or it will become zero if you pass more light on the LDR and if you pass a very little amount of light or no light is passed on the LDR it will be having the maximum resistance value. So this is the working principle when more light falls on the LDR the resistance will be decreased and the amount of light falling on the LDR is decreased the resistance will be increased. The vice versa case will be happening between the light and the resistance of the LDR. So the light falling on the LDR is inversely proportional to the resistance of the LDR. So here you can see a circuit. So this is the basic circuit using which you can interface this LDR to our microcontroller. That is as I said this LDR is a resistor. We are building a voltage divider with the help of this LDR. So I have connected the LDR resistor over here and the R2 resistor is available over here and the middle terminal is the analog out terminal which will be connected to the analog pin of the microcontroller. So now I have just connected a voltmeter that is a DC voltmeter which will display the amount of voltage coming out from the analog out pin of this voltage divider. Now I am playing the simulation. Initially you can see we are getting a very minimum amount of voltage in the analog output pin of the voltage divider circuit because no light falls on the LDR. So this LDR is isolating thoroughly this power rail from the middle terminal. It is having maximum resistance and when I increase the amount of light falling on the LDR you can see there is increase in voltage available in the analog out terminal. And when I pass maximum amount of light falling on the LDR, you can see the resistance of the LDR is much reduced to a minimum value. Almost I am receiving a maximum value of 4.76 out of 5 volt that I am providing to the voltage divider. So here I am providing a 5 volt signal and here now I am getting a 4.76 volts which is around the maximum value. So this is the working principle and using this simple voltage divider circuit with the help of LDR you can build and interface this LDR to any microcontroller. So based on the step value that we get in the analog input pin of the microcontroller you can build any application using this LDR. So the most common application of this light dependent resistor is that it is useful for sensing the daylight and night light. And now let's try to write a program in our microcontroller for reading out the analog voltage signal that is coming out as an output from the potential divider built using LDR. Initially I am just going to write a program for monitoring the values that is coming out of the LDR. Let's see and demonstrate the circuit that we have built right over here in the hardware. So I am just declaring the pin const int of analog pin is equal to A0. I am just going to use the A0 channel of the Arduino Uno. You can see these are the analog channels available in the Arduino Uno right. I am just going to use the A0 out of these six. And inside the void setup, I am just going to turn on the serial monitor for monitoring the step value coming out of the A0. I am just beginning the serial monitor with a baud rate of 9600. And coming inside the 
void loop i am just going to fetch the step value from the analog pin 0 that is the same process that we did for reading the analog values from the variable resistor in the previous lectures so i am just going to write inside the void loop that is step value is equal to i am going to use the analog read function call for reading the step value coming out of the analog pin 0 analog pin and once we read the analog pin we are just going to pass that and print that to the serial monitor step value print ln step value and finally I am giving a half a second delay you can see I am just directly reading the step value that I am receiving so this step value will be around 0 to 1023 which is the 10 bit step value of the ADC peripheral available inside the Arduino microcontroller and once we read the step value we will store the value to the step value variable and after that we are printing the string step value in the serial monitor and following that next to it we are printing the step value that we are fetching right over here and finally we are giving an enter by printing this step value with a print ln function and after that we are waiting here for half a second then the same process continues because these lines are written inside the infinite loop so i have written this program for monitoring the step value that is coming out of the circuit this one which we are going to build in the hardware i am just connecting the Arduino Uno development board to the pc through usb cable and i am uploading the sketch to the Arduino Uno development board now build the circuit to see the output in the hardware now that the code has been successfully dumped to the Arduino Uno development board, I am just going to open the serial monitor by clicking on the top right icon right over here. And you can see in the serial monitor that the step value that we fetch from the analog pin or from the LDR potential divider is around 29 and 30. Because my room light is only falling on the LDR, no other light source is falling on the LDR, so the LDR is maintaining a certain resistance. And when I suddenly increase the amount of light that is falling on the LDR with the help of my mobile phone torch light, you can see now the step value is around 400, 450 to 460. And when I further increase the amount of light that is falling on the LDR, you can see the step value now is around 800 to 900. It is around 890 to 900. And again further, if I increase that, you can see the LDR resistance is much reduced. That is almost the maximum voltage is passing through the middle terminal of the potential divider built using LDR. So the step value is nearing to the maximum value 1023. I am getting 980 to 990. So in this manner you can interface this LDR with the help of potential divider to the analog pin of this Arduino Uno. Now that we have successfully tested the voltage that is coming out of this circuit that we built. Now we are just going to write a program for turning on an LED when more amount of light is passed on the LDR. So I am just declaring an LED pin and I am going to connect it to the digital pin 7. And inside the void setup I am just going to configure this pin as output LED comma output. The programming logic is simple, when more amount of light is passed on the LDR, I will turn on the LED that is connected to digital pin 7 and if the amount of light falling on the LDR is lesser, I will turn off the LED. So this is the process. So I am just going to check for the step value to be greater than 512 which is the 50% of the step value. When I receive a step value 
greater than 512 digital right of led comma high if the step value that i receive is less than 512 if this condition fails i will turn off the led connected to digital pin 7 so when the amount of light that is falling on the ldr is increased or when i place the torch light on the top of the ldr this led that is connected to digital pin 7 will be glowing and if i remove the light and if i make the ldr dimmer the led connected to digital pin 7 will be turned off this is the logic so now i am just going to dump this program to the Arduino Uno development board now to my previous circuit i am just going to add an led to the digital pin 7 of Arduino Uno now you can see in the ideal position the led is turned off as we saw in the last serial monitor now when i place the light now when i increase the amount now when i increase the amount of light falling on the ldr by placing the torch light over the ldr the step value increases and the led is turned on when i remove the led is turned off Here you can see this is the output that I got in the hardware. See you in the next lecture. Thanks for watching.